everyone, welcome back to Geeking Out the Adult, where everything adult collectible is right here. And here we have it, the new Funko Pop Jurassic World Dominion, and oh my goodness. Before we get started, I'd like to thank Funko for sending me these to review. Oh my goodness, there are so many, so let's get started. First up, we have Ghost. Ghost is 12.05. This is so, on the back here we have the collector set here. Of course there are some exclusives, there are some larger sizes, but let's check out our first character. Wow, I love this. So I have been reviewing Funko for over seven years now and their attention to detail is getting much better. The stand is awesome, and check it out. That is a pretty cool ghost raptor from Jurassic World Dominions. But that is not the only one. Like I said, there are exclusives, so let's go ahead and check out the Target exclusive and see if there is any difference on these guys. Okay, so here they are side by side. I honestly can't tell too much of a difference except for the paint job on the eyeball. Maybe a little bit of a lighter color. Let me know in the comments down below if you know the differences between the regular Ghost and the Target exclusive. Also, don't forget to leave this video a big thumbs up. That will severely help my channel grow. Okay, do you know the two differences or the differences between the normal ghost and the Target exclusive. Next up, I want to check out Blue. There is Blue with Beta, which is, oh my goodness, a little tiny um, raptor. And then we have Blue all by himself. <gasps> this is my favorite from the series. We have blue with the little baby, and then we've got just blue by himself. This one probably is going to be my absolute favorite from this set. Which one do you guys prefer? Blue with the baby or blue by himself? We've got Claire, Maisie, Ian, and Dr. Sattler. The only person I am missing at this point is Owen, but let's check these out. Very cool attention to detail. Love the big Funko eyes. Claire's character comes with a base, which is usually super important because if you don't have the base, oh, she actually stands on her own, but usually they do topple over because iconically the Funko head is super big with super small bodies. Then we have the doctor here, all the way from Jurassic Park. And lastly, we have Dr. Sattler. So some fun facts about Funko, they usually display about two to three inches tall. Sometimes you can get them as big as like 16 inches, but my favorite spot to collect these and display these are in bookshelves or just generally on a shelf with all the boxes and all of their collectibles. And this one is going in my personal collection. But we are not done because there is so much more. We also have this dinosaur here, I'm not going to even try and say the name, but not only do they make Funko, they also make keychains, and they are awesome quality. Check that out. We do have a matching Funko to go along with this. So next up, whoa, we have this giant dinosaur here, Etherizonosaurus. I don't know how to say that one. Therizinosaurus. It also comes with a keychain. So the T Rex, I believe, and this dinosaur here both come in keychain form as well as Funko. But oh my goodness, oh, check out the detail, the claws on this one, and then the back. That is so cool. The keychain itself is like a miniature version of it. And for this character, instead of having the black common Funko eyes, it has a yellow eyeball, and that is so cool. The biggest dinosaurs are left, like the Gigantosaurus. I heard Top Pops call it a Giganosaurus. Am I saying it right, or is Top Pops saying it right? Is it 
Giganosaurus or Gigantosaurus. But here he is, very cool, super, super long uh, scales on his back and very, very scary. I was going to go see this movie. I was so excited to see it. And instead of my son wanting to go with me, he decided he wanted to go with dad. So dad got to go see the movie. I have not seen it yet, but I will get my chance. And last up, or actually second to last, we have another raptor. This time the raptor is in a brown color with kind of like this albino white. Like I said, I have not seen the movie yet. I really, really want to, but I wonder if he is a mix of like ghost and maybe blue, like another type of hybrid. Well, I only have one way to find out and that is by seeing the movie, but these dinosaurs are absolutely awesome. And last up, we have the most ferocious of the most ferocious dinosaurs. It's the T-Rex. Okay, so this one here, he's got brown colors with darker pigments on his face. You can see some detailing done on his mouth. He does have the classic black Funko eyes. and Okay, they are attached to the base, so you cannot remove them from the base, which is actually kind of nice because that way they can stand forever, inevitably. And then he also has a yellow beige stomach. Let me know which dinosaur is your favorite. These are some of the Funko from the Jurassic Park Dominion movie. And remember to leave a big thumbs up. Let me know which dinosaur is your favorite. Do you like blue or do you like blue with the baby back here? And what are the differences between the Ghost Target Edition and Normal Edition?